Ye's wife Bianca Sensori was spotted out for lunch on Thursday, July 25th, sporting yet another ridiculously short ensemble. Welcome back it's your host Nancy Brown. If you are new here make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel. During her meal at the opulent Shadow Marmont Hotel in Los Angeles, Sensori chose to wear a thin micro bikini that barely covered her chest. He accompanied the duo as they allegedly went into a studio together after getting lunch. The dress code for the hotel is smart casual. This is merely the most recent obscene sighting of Bianca Sensori in the past few weeks. When Bianca Sensori was seen on July 17 sporting an almost translucent top without a bra, trousers, or anything except skin-colored underwear, she definitely pushed the boundaries. Ye was dressed appropriately, of course, in sweatpants and a black sweatshirt. She was spotted exiting in Los Angeles. Tanning parlor on July 16 wearing a translucent top without a bra underneath. She was also wearing shorts that were almost transparent. The married pair was then seen dining at Bloodsoe's BBQ in Los Angeles on July 13. Bianca was dressed in a tiny bikini top that barely covered her breasts. Despite the fact that Bianca Sensori has been in the news a lot lately, Ye made an effort to protect his spouse from the media on a Tuesday lunch date. Ye didn't seem to want any pictures of Sensori taken that day, despite the fact that she was dressed in one of her trademark translucent tan ensembles complete with heels and a baseball cap. Ye didn't seem to mind that it was in some ways less revealing than many of her other prior fits. Ye is seen in pictures putting Bianca behind him to stop the paparazzi from taking pictures of her. During her recent visit to Shadow Marmont, Australian model Bianca Sensori demonstrated her impeccable sense of style. She and her spouse Kenya West made an appearance at the popular La Eatery earlier today, capturing attention with her shocking outburst. Sensori looked stunning in a virtually non-existent white bikini top, accessorizing with a basic black heel and a pair of small white shorts. Ye, as usual, wore a rather casual outfit to let Sensori steal the show. He had on a pair of dark sunglasses, matching sports shorts, and a basic black hoodie. Stepping out of Ye's Cybertruck, Sensori flaunted her summary ensemble, seemingly unaffected by the business casual dress code of the opulent hotel. Naturally, this isn't the first time the well-known couple has eaten at the Shadow lately, so it's safe to assume that the employees are used to her outrageous outbursts. For instance, she and Ye returned this week to have lunch. Sensori's thin nude dress, stockings, heels, and basic baseball cap left little room for interpretation. Earlier this month, she showed off her creative side by dressing on a date night without wearing any pants at all. Instead, she wore a thong with a white blouse. The couple reportedly went to a nearby studio following their most recent lunch rendezvous. Whether Ye was planning something or not is unknown because, just a few weeks ago, he appeared to be hinting at his retirement. Fans may have to wait and see what this implies for Vultures 2 in the meantime. According to a source, Bianca Sensori's father wants to speak with Kenny West because he believes the rapper is severing his daughter from her family and using her as a trashy commodity. According to reports, Leo Sensori, whose brother is a well-known gangland murderer, has shown interest in having a conversation with the rapper on his recent actions. Bianca's father Leo wants to have a proper sit-down with Kenny and ask him what the hell he is thinking when he parades Bianca around like a trashy naked trophy pony, a source close to Bianca told the outlet. He wants to ask Kenny what he would do if his daughters North, or Chicago, were seen in public half-naked in outfits encouraged by their husbands. He knows that there is no way in hell that Kenny would allow this for his daughters so it makes no sense why he would encourage this for his own wife, they added. The 29-year-old former architect has been spotted out and about in recent months sporting ostentatious ensembles that range from sheer tops, and tights to acting totally naked in public. The source was informed by insiders that Leo and his family feel that Bayaka's family has been torn apart by the Jesus Walks hitmaker. Leo's concerns echo a similar sentiment expressed by Bianca's pals in January, who claimed that the rapper had banned her from using social media for her own protection. I am the real homie, I no chance. A random guy in the street who was prepared to yell and rave loudly approached Kenny West, and Bianca Sensori, giving them a very Los Angeles experience. You're so new, so nifty. You ain't shit, boy. As he and his spouse strolled back to their Range Rover on Sunday, a passerby who appeared out of nowhere began an oddly personal rant against Kenny West while they were going about their own business on Melrose Place. Son, who? I ain't no kid cutting. I ain't cutting, dog. The outspoken man here seemed to be rather scared by Kenny and Bianca who were returning to flaunting their curves in a form-fitting dress. He even briefly blocked their way as they were pulling out and heading away. Jeez. And appeared to be upset with Kanye. In addition, the man warned them that they were in his area and continued to make references to the devil, Lucifer, while making ominous hand gestures. This is my block. I am homeless 12 years, 
day. Once he was safely in the car with Bianca, Candy allowed the guy have his say. But he didn't rush off, instead, he cracked his window to get an earful. Thankfully, there was no physical altercation, but he appeared to be satisfied with allowing the man to release some steam. Even though celebrities, like Kanye, who is prone to outbursts, rarely deal with it, normal people in Los Angeles are accustomed to this situation. That's it for today, thanks for watching. Tell us what you think in the comment section and most importantly subscribe. See you.